Celtics is sold out and noisy inside here in Boston. It's the NBA brought to you by 2K Sports on this very special Easter Sunday. Kevin Harlan with Clark Kellogg and Steve Kerr. Doris Burke joining us from the sideline. This Boston crowd ready to roar in this Eastern Conference matchup for the Celtics. And brought to you by State Farm. Look at Philadelphia's starting lineup. The captain, he's in at the point. Paul George is out there with G and Lee. Then there's Martin, and it's Booker in at the center, filling out the middle. And for Boston, Pearson KG at the three and the four. Ando and Allen make up the backcourt, and it's Bogut in at the pivot spot, manning the middle. Yeah, what's going on everybody? It's iPod King Carter here, the Superman of YouTube. Yes, we're starting off just like that, man. We starting off with an alley-oop. Me to Paul George, man. Dom City has came to Boston. What will they do? <laughs> um, I just want to say happy Easter to everyone. Um, you can notice in this gameplay, this is an actual game on Easter. Um, if you're watching this, most likely if you're a Celtics fan or a Sixers fan, root for your team tonight. You know, um, I'm going to be in full effect watching the game on CSN Sports. So hopefully, you know, all you fans out there, check it out. Now, check me out on a nice three pointer after I ran a play. Now, that play was designed for a backdoor cut. But I just decided to shoot the three. Now check me out with a nice inbound steal. I'm going to go all the way in for the layup. I'm not going to take any prisoners this game. Because on Hall of Fame, you just can't take anybody lightly. Now, notice I might have jumped the whole lot. That's because I got subbed out because I was fouling a little bit too much. I was a little bit too overzealous. But check me out on a nice fast break three-pointer. Now, moving on. One thing you might notice, I'm trying to play awesome defense. I'm trying to show you guys that I do got a little bit of defense, man. I do got some good on-ball D. Check me out as I block um, Rondo right there. I don't know why he was trying to take a jump shot. He should have gave it to Pierce or somebody who has better stats at that. Now, check out this play. Even though I didn't show it, I had to show the replay, man. What was Rondo thinking? I'm nice in a post. I don't know what he was thinking, but coming down, you're going to realize that one reason on Hall of Fame why you can't take a command and lead is because of stupid stuff like this. Now notice, no play is really being ran. Gardner is just going to step into his range and take the jumper. My teammate did nothing to stop that. He didn't step up in his face. He didn't contest it, anything. So, you know, I was kind of mad about that. But check me out running my nice little play again. I love this play because I have the choice to shoot the three-pointer or look at the back door cut. That's too easy, man. Oh, my goodness. For all you point guards out there, all you gamers, not just people on YouTube, all you gamers out there, if you got a point guard, my player, oh, that pissed me off, too. I don't know how Rondo hit the three, but we're going to get into that later. But if you're a point guard and you want to call plays, I advise you to because you don't want to be running to that blue icon, not understanding what play you're going to be running the entire day. But check me out as I get back that three-pointer, man. I was mad that Rondo hit that three, so I had to hit one back. But yeah, man, all you point guards out there, trust me. That's what you want to do, man. You want to run your own plays. You don't want 2K dictating what you're going to do the entire game. Let's get into halftime. Welcome to the HP Halftime Report here on Easter Sunday. I can't resist myself. Let's hop to it. The Celtics taking care of business. The offense has been unreal. Defense incapable of stopping it. Well, Paul Pierce is making it look easy against the 76ers. He has 17 points, and he's applying defensive pressure, adding some steals as well. And no quitting the 76ers. They came to win. Sharp shooting from downtown. They're raining triples nonstop. And a look here at some of the top two performers in the first half. Oh, they're worthy of the spotlight. A lot in the NBA to catch up on. Let's check it out as we go around the league. Man, that was messed up how they only show one highlight play from my team. It's okay, though. We're going to make up for that. I'll give you a highlight play. Oh, yeah. I'll give you a highlight play. Slam can, baby. Right on you, Paul Pierce. You want to you wanna mess around and keep scoring on my man, Paul George? I got something for you. Now, also, Rondo, he wouldn't have 15 points if I'd have played the entire two quarters. He'll probably have about four points, but check me out on the break. I'm going to lay this man up. I'm going right at his chest. You know what I'm saying? That's a little bit of advice for, to my man, Wiser now. Team five-minute quarters. <laughs> um, check me out at the foul line, man. This play right here pissed me off. Now, I know you guys noticed that I'm playing on Hall of Fame or whatever, but check this out, man. Just check out this nice little thing that Ray Allen's going to do. Pull-up jumper. Jesus 
fucking Shuttlesworth, man. How in the fuck are you going to let a player just come down and pull up for three? I just can't understand that, man. Like, and, and the whole entire time, it was pissing me off, and I was getting frustrated. So, you know what I did. I tried to go to the pick and roll, and now I get fouled out. Now we're in the fourth quarter. Yes, I know, guys. I'm in foul trouble. I won't foul again. I promise. I promise I won't foul again, but I got something I want to show you guys. I'm coming up and pulling up for three, too. If Jesus Shuttleworth can do it, I can do it, too. Real talk. If Ray Allen is able to just come down and pull up for these wide open threes, I can do it, too. Now, check it out as my man Yee cuts to the basket. Now, check this out. My man Kmart in the corner. That boy is wet from three, man. I don't care what nobody says. I could pass it to him with two seconds left on the clock. That thing is going down. <laughs> now, check out Bogut in the post. You already know what we're going to do, man. We're going to try to get this, you know what I'm saying, nice shot clock violation popping. You know, so look at all this ball movement. They're doing too much. Nobody's open. So, you know what I do? I play stellar defense. That's what I'm into, man. Look at Rondo. He mad. You mad, Rondo? <laughs> Now, all this bumping animations and stuff like that pisses me off so much. So, you know, I had to just kick it to my man, Booker. I was mad. Now, one thing was, we are still down. So, you know what I had to do, man? I had to go in the post. I had to go in Rondo's chest. Yes. My man got his fifth personal. You already know what it is, man. I'm going to the line. I'm trying to shoot these free throws. The camera didn't even want to switch for me, y'all. So, you know, I had got that 80% late, but I still cashed it. It's all good. We good. Now, I'm trying to run my sweet little play again. Notice I'm running it with somebody different. This time I'm running it with Terrence Williams. So, you already know what's coming. Dom City, baby. Go catch it. That play right there is awesome i'm telling you um what is it called i think it's called uh alley that's what it's called so i'm guessing they want to call it a back a back door alley cutter i don't know what they're what the play is actually called i just know that i can run it with any player on my team i can get lobs i can get assists or i can shoot the open three just like ray allen just shot fuck <laughs> ray allen just shot that we need a timeout man Jesus fucking Shuttlesworth, man. This dude can hit it from anywhere, man. I swear to goodness, yo. I think he can hit it from the three-point line on the other side of the court. I'm telling you. But check out Pearson and Post. You already know I'm stuck to Delonte West. I'm not going to let this dude score for nothing, man. I'm going to keep shuffling back and forth, man. Now, notice. Stellar defense. I can't. I just can't let these guys score, man. If I let Ray Allen score, then you already know what it is. I'm going to get the L, and I can't have that. So check out my man, Kmar. I told you, if I give it to Kmar, he going to hit it, right? <laughs> I told y'all this a few seconds ago. Y'all better stop playing with him. He nice, man. Now, it's a minute and a half left in the game. We're trying to put the nails in the coffin, so you already know what it is. Garnett, ice cold veins, man. This dude just hit a leaner. A fucking leaner. I don't know how he did that, but it pissed me off so much. So you already know what I got to do. I got to go back and round those chests. It's only right this dude is too short, man. Real talk. I may be only be six foot, but he's short than me, man. Real talk. You know what I'm saying? The boy, he needs some more meat on his bones, man. <laughs> now I'm going to the line, you know. About to shoot these Durant five-second free throws. Team five-second free throws. Let's get it popping. You know what I'm saying? We about to get this thing rolling. Now, check out the LeBron nines. You already know what it is, man. Plus five dunk. Who wouldn't want to wear these shoes? Now, with these shoes, all my dunk is at an 85. And I'm loving it. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> no, no shout out to McDonald's, by the way. <laughs> Perfect release. 100% pure. They got to take a time out. Now, we're up two. 30 seconds left, man. What do you guys think is going to happen, man? I'm not going to tell you guys nothing. I'm going to just let you watch this. Check out fucking Garnett. You already knew what it was, man. As soon as Garnett was in the post, you already knew what it was. Cash, man. So we coming down with 25 seconds left on the clock, man. You know what it is, man. We running the pick and roll. I can't have it. Come on, cut, baby. It's all good. I'm going to take it in the post. Ah! Right in his chest. I'm t I live in the paint. That's like my second home. <laughs> Come on, I got a point guard, I got a small forward, and I got a center. They all take it to the paint, baby. I got to put the last nail in the coffin right here. You already know what it is. I'm burying this whole team alive. You know what I'm saying? I got to bury Boston alive. Come on. Here it go right here. I better not miss. Slightly early, but I still hit it. 
They got to take the time out now. We're up three. The nails is already planted. You know, the coffin is already buried. But Ye just has to be the man right there. Good play, Ye. He came out with the steal. So you already know what it is, man. Now, I'm lowering the casket. Rest in peace. I'm putting him six feet under. You know, I put the nice little ribbon on it. I got the I got the roses. Everybody tossing roses. You know the crowd. The crowd is real real silent right now as I hit these five second free throws. I'm sorry, boss, and it's not my fault. Hopefully, the real Philadelphia 76ers can win against Boston today. Um, we lost to the Magic last night. It was a real bad loss, man. I really thought that we had that game, and you know it, it really it really just ah it just pissed me off, man. But Come on, Sixers. We can do this, man. I know we can get to the playoffs in a nice spot, you know what I'm saying? So, hopefully they win that game today. You know, I'm going to be watching. I don't know about y'all. You know what I'm saying? It's going to make my Easter Sunday all that. <laughs> you feel me? Now, I know what y'all want to hear. I know I know what y'all want to hear. <laughs> y'all want to hear that Dime City music, right? I already know what it is, man. I got it for y'all, man. Also, if y'all don't know who made this beat, it's Team Air Studio TV. Shout out to him. Um, Y'all can definitely go in the description. Oh my God. I don't know how many times I got to say this. If you're on a computer watching this video, go in the description. I got a lot of info in there that y'all might want to know about my my player, about people who make my beats, my channels, my Twitter, my Facebook, all of that. Just hit up that description, man. So, you know, in the comment section, people won't be telling y'all, go to the... Another month, another Player of the Month award in the books for you. How have you been able to sustain this level of play through so much of this season? Man, all I got to say is the playoffs is coming, baby. Don't you understand? We just won this game on Easter. The playoffs is right around the corner. Let's go. I ain't got nothing else to say. I've been working hard, man. I don't take a day off during the summer because whenever you're resting, you're giving your comp competitors an opening to get an edge on you that they don't need to have. And it's nice to finally see all that hard work paying off. The individual awards though, that's one thing. The real validation will come at the end of the year when we're hopefully still out there playing for the NBA title. Also, my next video will be all the ending stats, MVP awards, and everything like that. Alright y'all, Sai KC signing out. Peace.